Everybody, um, so right now it's fall and uh, the weather is getting cool right now. So um, I see a very interesting kind of virus that, uh, that I want to uh, show you. All. And this virus is often uh, been uh, mistaken as a black spot. And it is known as the rose mosaic virus. So as you can see, this is my Huntington rose. Uh, I already have this rose for this is the third year. Okay, this is the third year of my uh, Huntington. And uh, I'm gonna show you this Huntington rose they have when during the fall and the springtime, it will start to uh, show up. Let me remove some of the the dew. You see how wet it is over here in the morning here. But uh, you can see that during the spring or the fall season when the weather is cool, uh, you will start. I will start see this kind of leaf that is coming out. You see how the leaf has some sort of the um, pattern of the uh, the yellow, and then it's like it almost like a look like a variegated uh, kind of a uh, leaf. Let me show you more. Um, it usually showed up when it is cool like uh, in spring or in in fall you see how how the pe the leaf has become like this color when the regular leaf looks like this okay so this is called the rose mosaic uh, virus so the rose mosaic virus is not a kind of virus that can that will spread first of all it doesn't spread uh, so if you have it don't worry that uh, the rose nearby this uh, like surrounding it will not get rose mosaic it doesn't spread like regular um like black spot and something like that. it doesn't spread okay and and the thing and also it it might look ugly on the on the bush but it really doesn't kill the the bush it really doesn't do anything to the to the bush okay it just different leaf color like I can show you like this this is my Huntington you can see it bloom very very well okay it has so many buds and it form buds all the time you can see that right Ooh, look at that sorry I got distracted let's show you the the duck is coming to my area <laughs> sorry Okay, come back to the rose <laughs> Um And you can you can see. Oh, look at this cute little froggy! Oh my god, <laughs> I didn't even notice it. Um, yeah, but but yeah, you can see how the bloom is still continue. Oh, you are so cute! Look at her. Oh, come on, let's go back. There you go. Um, and and yeah, and and you can you can tell it's still it's still growing really really well and um. Just because you see that doesn't mean it's not a healthy rose because obviously this rose is as healthy as it can be, okay? And um, and it doesn't spread, so you don't need to go and pull it out or just remove it. It just, you don't need to do anything. You don't need to spray. There's nothing for you to spray it out, okay? Um, it just looks very different <laughs> that's why they call it rose mosaic now how how is this rose get rose mosaic um so it actually uh it was passed from the mother plant of this uh, where they pick they use a the cutting to propagate this rose like this is uh grafted on a futunana root, 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 root stock so when the nursery cut the uh, get a cutting from a mother plant with the rose mosaic virus then the plant, then then the cutting, then the the, the the cutting that propagated from it will have rose mosaic virus. So as long as you do not use this rose to propagate, you don't propagate like for on root, you don't propagate, you don't graft it, you will not pass it down. If it makes sense to you, just don't propagate this rose, and then it will be stay the rose mosaic will stay with this plant so this is why it's it's quite important for y'all to 
if you see that your rose has rose mosaic, it's really quite important for you to report um, to the nursery that sell you the rose so that they can tell the where the source is from and they will stop propagate from the mother plant with the rose mosaic, okay? But again, you can continue to grow that rose. It's not gonna make it short life. It's not, it's, it's gonna be fine. Don't worry about it, okay? I, I love this Huntington so much because it's so bushy and so healthy and all that, you know, and it bloom and bloom and bloom. So I have this rose for three years already. So I can tell you very confident that don't worry about this, okay? It, it doesn't do anything to it. So there you go. Hope uh, it helps. Um, hope it helps you all. And again, it, you will not see this in the summertime. It only show up during the spring and fall when it's cool. The, where the, the temperature is cool. Okay, so something to keep in mind. This is not a black spot. This is called the rose mosaic virus. And it's actually kind of cool to look at sometimes. <laughs> I know you probably will not think that, but I think it's pretty cool. It's almost like a variegated rose leaf. All right, there you go. Hopefully it helps. And uh, let me know if you have any question in my video, in my comment, okay? All right, talk to you then, bye.